Welcome to my engineering drawing playlist. Today we will discuss about problem on the projections of solids. And this is the single stage problem related to the prism. So let's see first of all the description of the given problem. Draw projections of hexagonal prism raised on VP with one base H parallel to HP such that its axis perpendicular to VP and parallel to both HP and PP. That means profile plane. Take side of base prism as 20 mm and axis length 50 mm. Once again, we are going to follow this simple procedure for the projection of solid. If you want to refer these three stages with the help of the example, then you can refer my earlier video of the procedure for the projection of solid. Here you can see in the first stage, you have to assume either X is perpendicular to HP or perpendicular to VP. And here it is given to you, draw the projection of hexagonal prism raised on VP with one base H parallel to HP, such so that its axis perpendicular to VP. So keep in mind here, axis is perpendicular to VP as given to you. And so that you can see the base of the hexagonal prism in the front view as a true shape and so that you should start with the front view for this problem. So it is like this hexagonal prism raised on VP with one base H parallel to HP. So here you can see one base H that is parallel to HP. Here you can see this is the HP and this H is parallel to HP such that its axis, here you can see axis is perpendicular to VP and at the same time it is parallel to HP and it is parallel to PP also. Take side of base prism as 20 mm, so side of base as 20 mm and axis length as 50 mm. So once again, you have to imagine this figure in your mind. It is not required to draw in the examination. So here you can understand the true shape of the base can be seen in the front view. And so that you should start from the front view for the first stage. So here you can understand this is the hexagonal prism and this is the profile plane. So here you can see axis is parallel to profile plane as well as parallel to HP, but it is perpendicular to VP. So first of all, draw the reference line XY. Next, start with the front view because of true shape of the base can be seen in the front view. And you can see front view like this. Now give the name, let's say it is A, B, C, D, E, F. You can follow in anti-clockwise direction or in clockwise direction also. And give the name for the bottom corner point also. So it is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Now if you see in the front direction, then you can see A and 1 both are on the same point. So here you can understand now it should be a dash one dash similarly here you can see b and two both should be on the same point so it should be b dash two dash similarly now you can understand c dash three dash d dash four dash next e dash five dash and f dash six dash again this is the front view so all the names should be with the dash and with the small letter now it's turn for the front view and height is given to you as 50 mm so that you can imagine this rectangle should be over here. So you can take height as a 50 mm over here. So this is the boundary for the rectangle. Now draw the projection from each corner point. So here you can see in the top view, you can see one point over here and this is the point A, so it will be like that. So you can give the name over here 1A. Similarly, 
you can now understand it should be b2 similarly it should be coincide with f6 also so it should be like this to 6 over here and here it will be f and b so you can understand now it should be to 6 and it should be b f similarly you can understand now c 3 5 then it will be d and 4 so this is the rectangle for the front view so at last you should draw the dark line for the outer surface of the top view as well as in the front view and this edge should be dark also because of it will be visible in the front view so this is the very simple concept for the projection of solid as far as the first stage is concerned next time we will see more problems of the projection of solid for the two stages and three stages thanks my dear friends for watching this video press the like button to appreciate it